Alrighty guys, you guys clicked on this video just because of the title. Just how big are my small scale collection is? Just how big is it? Look at that dog. Maisie! Come on puppy dog, let's go! Not puppy anymore, she's six years old. I got a barn in a silo sitting up there. I don't have any room for in these bins. This guy's cool. One of my knives sitting there. Just how big we got. These two are full. We got one, two, three. But they're not all just tractors. Some of them are cars in there from Matchbox. So, what you guys, next, you guys are going to see, you're going to see them all lined up. I'm going to just make lines like combines, tractors, implements, stuff. And I will show you guys just how big this collect the the small scale collection really is and then the next one will be of those i have a pretty big collection overall if i were to line all these up they'll probably stretch down there that's my sister's stuff by the way it's not mine these are my bro me and my brothers one's mine one's my brothers what you doing me what you doing so yeah i'm gonna get this all set up One boom, that stagger. Uh oh, he's alone. I need to throw my arm in there. Mm. Hang on, this one's a pain because there's a combine sitting here. We've got the anniversary 95, the 8110, 338, 8020, 5090. That's one of my favorite Jersey trucks I've had. Very good condition. No Ford, that looks like an F 250. I like this style of Ford, though. I assume it's an F-250. My dad could correct me on that. So, anyways. This one. We got all that. Now I'm going to set them up. So. It'll be a millisecond. We'll probably take a few minutes or a half hour for me to turn these lights on. So, they shine a little better when I do that. But I'm going to leave them off for now. Because I like something like that. So, anyways. Now I'm going to do this second part again. Because I don't like how I did this other part. So, we got them all lined up. Got the buildings over there, one construction that's the same scale, it's not bigger. We have a 8000 series, all dueled up, die cast in the grill are cracked and gone. Lawnmower 80, 50, case magnum 335, case international 7130. I think that's a 6400, I think that's an 8400. Don't know because you do not see model numbers 4020, 2510 anniversary edition. 96, 20, 81, 10 with the skinny back wheels. Stagger. CA, 325. 50, 20, 40th anniversary edition. Same as the 2510. I think that's a six, uh, the newer 6000 series with duels. 80, 20 diesel. Cat Challenger number 65. A dealer edition, 95 combine. The anniversary edition of the 95 combine is 7720 Titan II, 9510 John Deere Maximizer, 90, 90, John Deere 9600, a 9760, 9860 STS, 9870, yep, 9860, 9870, the big boy, W260 Wonder Hour. 9986 combine one of my specialty combines as I call them the second specialty combine is oops set John Deere 7500 forage harvester I got a header for it two chopper boxes which I did buy at a different time not the same time we got four different corn heads five if you count the forage head for the chopper big hydroflex head fits on all of the combines except the 95s and the Titan II because this one's got the wider feeder house on it than the rest of these do. That's got a, this has got a normal size wider, a bit wider. Then we got a haybine. Can't remember the model that one because it, it, the model is scratched off. The 56B round bearer mega wide plus. 1618 brush hog. 338 small, John Deere small square barrel. John Deere box spreader. 
uh, auger wagon. It it, it said it looks like a grinder, but I'm not sure what it is. It Erdo makes these in every uh, brand there is. I bent the hitch on just because it would sit in the hitches of the tractor a lot better. Got a 2200 field cultivator, my second one because it the uh, last one fell apart. 637 grinder disc, 712 chisel plow, 1590 grain drill, 1770 NT with the CCS seed delivery, die cast truck trailer, as I call it. You got the LB433 big square baler. I think that's a 3x4. Just a little animal trailer. There's three small wagons. Anhydrous tank with the IH running gear. Another anhydrous tank with the John Deere running gear and IH flare box. John Deere flare box. A deer sprayer. A Chase farm systems trailer came with an F-150 which I can't seem to find. You saw it in my display video though. I have two chopper boxes. But it's still fit on the back of that guy. But there... That one's got the top messing on it. That one doesn't, obviously. One without the top is got is starting to have rust form. Got a what I call a bale trailer. That's got a heavily bent back axle, front axle. Two flatbeds. My favorite semi. Yeah. We go and grab. Ugh. One of my favorites. Story time for another day on why the diecast is a little scratched. My first semi and the longest lasting semi I actually have. And probably my, and my favorite. Okay, and the die cast trailer and a tractor. I do not remember the tractor it came with. I might not even have the tractor. I got a, a white John Deere Peterbilt, as I call it. Looks like a Peterbilt. Color is white plastic. I don't like the plastic ones. It's just die cast, though. We have the black. Again, I call these a Peterbilt Western Star, whatever you want to call it smaller truck than the big truck same these have two of those a flatbed truck and my favorite pickup truck if i had the ford f-150 i would show that to you but i can't find it it's an f-250 this this one is not the other one john deere company on the old one old version of it what my favorite some i have my favorite some what am i thinking favorite pickup truck I have another one of these, but all the tires are gone missing. I found a four set of these tires. Can't remember if they came off the other one. But these have been on here ever since I found them. Looks pretty good, though. Big tires on it, though. Then we're going to get in. Then I have what I call a sound guard backhoe because it looks like the sound guard cab. Correct me if I'm wrong. This thing is old, 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 old. I've had this thing for a good many years. Now I know they probably still make them, but this is the older one because you can see all the die cast on it. I don't, I do not know because I don't have very many new small scale construction equipment. But I'm sure you like the looks of this one. We have a little uh, shop. It's got a connector on the back. We got a little uh, barn that a lean to. Is, I think that's what the name is. Got a connector. Connected to the middle piece. Now, in the end piece would be the concrete silo. I'll show you. Here's the shop. They just kind of... Hang on. Get this one kind of set up for you guys. I'll put on my dirty dog. Put on there. They just kind of slide in the place, and you just kind of slide them up. I'll stick together. This is how I normally keep it. It looks kind of cool, like an old style farm. Then you got a harvester. Don't know why that's sitting there. So yeah, that is the entire. Well, not in the entire. That is about 90% of the small scale collection. I call these small scale just because they're smaller than. Nah, I can't remember what scale. I have to look at the chart I have on my phone. And these are all, I have a lot of combines. I don't have very many here. I only got two planters. I want to get a second grain drill and another, and I want to get a 12 row corn planter. I got 15, 
1750 or whatever the 12 row model of the 1700 is and there's a cat challenger the steiger a few case internationals but i only have two one of them is my brothers i'm very proud of this collection and probably the next video you guys will see it will be on the big one i'll take those out i'll line them up to take you through all of them but that won't be to that won't be tomorrow though you're probably going to get one or you're probably going to get two videos this week so yeah this is about 90 percent of the collection there's a few tonkas and whatever there's more construction tonka toys and whatnot that i have but i didn't want to put them in there because they're not die cast they're majority plastic with yeah, they're majority plastic, but these ones, they're some, they're either all die cast or half, or over half die cast. Like that one right there is like more plastic, but I still bring it out because it is part of the real collection. I'm only, I'm going to start expanding this one more. I'm going to add more tractors, more combine, get a new 7720 Titan 2. I think I had a Titan 1 at one point for a model. I can't remember. I got one up in Michigan and one here. I got that one in Michigan though. Early 2000s, the heads are gone for, but they will not fit those heads. They won't. Gotta go. Someone's home. So thanks for watching. Please comment, rate, ugh, and subscribe. Catch you guys in the next video, which I'll bet you how much you guys want to bet they're going to be on this one. I already know, though. <laughs> so, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you guys in the next video.